host. Oh, yeah, there we go. Episode. Perfect tra- mid episode transition. <laughs> Let's go to the Armor Outpost. It's a DMX song. Oh, y'all gonna make me lose my Money, mind. Cash host. Money, cash host. What? Is that a yeah. Regal deer woman. He yells what? So yeah. Um, she's so. She's a deer, deer lady. Lady. <laughs> lady. Oh, dear. I get it. She's a little bit more regal than the fucking horse woman. <laughs> I have to admit. There's another deer lady. A frog guy. And just a normal lady. I need to get up here. You do. Um, I might have to fight the haberdasher first. Yeah. Haberdasher is going down. Word on the street is haberdasher is going down. Going down, baby. Oh. And this year's Summer Slam. Look at this ostrich. She's not an ostrich. Peacock. She's a peacock woman. Tommy told me peacocks used to live in the woods behind his house, and I don't believe him, but he sounds so convinced. <laughs> Nay. Sounds so convinced. What did you want? A thousand gold? Uh, sure. Oh, I got peacocks. <laughs> got fleeced, bitch. Do I, I think I, I have to pay all of them to be able to fight this guy. I think you're right. This is shitty. This is terrible. This is bad game design. Bad game feel. <laughs> I got the nice hat achievement. Mr. Hat. He's he is. He's also a knight. He's got like a Spartan helmet. <laughs> well, boss fight in a store. Mention it in your review of the game so you can be cool. He fucking comes at you. He does. He's a fucking Dark Souls villain. Yeah, well, he's about as threatening as Lord Gwen. I'm going to board this motherfucker. Oh, right, so we can have Dark he Souls 3 thing. Yeah, it'll be something, all right. <laughs> Miyazaki has no fucking idea what he's doing. <laughs> what else has Miyazaki done besides Dark Souls? Well, I guess he was working on From Software games. You know, they make Armored Core. I didn't know that. Yeah, and some other games that nobody's ever heard of. <laughs> what was that game on the N64 where you played a robot and you had to run and like destroy stuff. Blast core? Yeah. Jesus Christ that game. We should play that. <laughs> I'm lightheaded. I don't think I've ever it. played that game. I, oh no, that's wrong. I played it on uh, the, the like demo setup of the N64 they had in Kmart back in the day. No, Kmart? Yeah, I think that's right. Alright. The Habba Dasher is teaching us how to dash across the roofs in a Habba light nice manner. Summer. Yeah. Here we go. I can finally get the armor I want. Fuck yeah. So the red armor, its benefit is you drop half as much money when you die, but the benefit to me is that I think it looks the best, and so it's the only one I use. What do the other ones do? One makes your magic better. One of them makes it where you like don't get knocked back as far, but mm-hmm. I think you slide more. And one of them uh, is gold. I think the gold one doesn't do anything, right? It's just gold. Yeah. I like this one. I like it. I want it. I'll have it. Thank you. Thank you kindly. (laughs) Mr. (laughs) Haberdasher. This guy won't do anything until I have a horn to blow. This man is a rooster. (laughs) Airship enthusiast. (laughs) There's something so regal about a rooster man. Oh, he's got like knickers on too. Like they're like pulling up. What would a a rooster man would definitely wear knickers or breeches? Is that breeches? Yeah. I learned all of my armor and clothing types from Final Fantasy XI. <laughs> Is that Zubaz? Are you ready for some tank memes? He made the frame rate drop again. The world map is the most frame-intensive part of this game, apparently. I don't, I don't understand. I don't either. Nobody understands. Yeah, he's a Zubaz. The Bass. I know there's a bunch of uh, Kickstarter people in like the Hall of Heroes or whatever. Yeah. Including the Grumps. Okay, Baz. Let's do it. I know uh, the PS, the PlayStation version of this game has Kratos in it, I believe. As like a boss. Uh, boss? Yeah, a wandering boss. You need a damn rope on your head. That's so cool. He swings around quite a bit. I'll give him that. He's got that going for him. Like some kind of monkey. 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 The monkey. Uh, speaking of monkeys, I finally tried uh, Chunky Monkey Ben and & Jerry's and it's goddamn delicious. It is really good. Awesome right now. The Baz has lost his shit. The background changed. I've never had a bad Ben and Jerry's. I've tried several since our uh, investigative report during uh, Dark Souls playthrough. That people seem to like. Yeah. The Chunky Monkey's hidden. You'll notice it's nowhere in that little video. Yeah. Uh, we have I, footage. <laughs> it's in the next section. Like, a little subsection of, like, the Hagen dazs is the American Cone 
and the Chunky Monkey. Oh, it's like in the spillover section? I was so taken aback when I finally found it. He's, his temper tantrum has made the frame rate drop. Everything about the Baz is awful. I don't understand anything about <laughs> frame rate. Nobody does. I'm going to buy a charge up. You know attack. when the frame rate doesn't drop? When you're playing on a fucking console. Yeah. Unless you're playing, you know, a triple A game. And yeah. then the frame rate loses its shit the entire time. You're playing a triple A game in the first six months it exists. Oh, Jesus. That's what you just do like me and just buy games five years after they come out. That's what I do. Yeah. Or I just don't buy them at all because I hate all modern games anyway. <laughs> so let's continue with this game that came out in 2013. <laughs> <laughs> was it 2013? Or 14. It was like, I mean, t- maybe 2012, but Coney never forget. But Coney? <laughs> oh, I get it. Um, it's funny. But yeah, I mean, this is a relatively new game. Yeah, I know. I mean, I don't like any... I don't like some games. <laughs> when I said I don't like any games, I mean, I don't like some. I mean, there are certain games I like and don't. Oh, my lord, the far. There's a far. Lord, honey. Woo! Woo! Feats don't fail me now. Oh, God. Dank Sparks! <laughs> you ever drank a Sparks? Uh, yes. They're very strange. They are. Uh, there goes the goddamn frame rate again. The f- that was the a flag rat. The thing is, I don't. I never know if that's showing up in the recording or not. Like, yeah. when I go to edit this together as an episode. Like, Fraps picks it up, so you would assume. Or the Plague Rats, their greatest ability is they eat your frame rate. <laughs> Plague Rats sounds like a group that uh, Solid Snake would have to fight. The Plague Rats? It's like, Snake, you're going up against the Plague Rats. And he's like, what? Beg <laughs> more? Go in. Ow. Um, you what, mate? <laughs> you what, mate? <laughs> That's my Solid Snake fucking impression. do you. Bob's your uncle? Um, I can't handle this fucking frame rate drop. And we're playing this on my sh- shitty plasma TV, so the frame, the resolution is like 1162 by something. <laughs> it's not like it's goddamn huge. It's not 4K. This computer, I downloaded somehow The Witcher 3 and played it, and it fucking ran it fine, but not goddamn Shovel Knight. Logic. Logic Bomb. Golden Trout. Whatever even went and saw the Trout King. Not that I care. Oh, uh, yeah. Do you have to go to a specific place to... to yeah, he, he's got a spot on the map that he hangs out. What those travel things. Travel things. Pregu Ratado. Did you know the rats didn't actually spread the plague? It was the fleas that was on them. I did know that. Rats get such bad reps, huh? That's well, why I mean, I'm starting a rap PR firm. Because they're gross. <laughs> sometimes. 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 Sometimes rats. Sometimes they're adorable. Eh. I need to throw an anchor at you. Yeah! You yeah! Think I had a problem solving like that. So Wait, you you have some friends who have a pet yeah. pig. Uh, yeah. Do they still cook bacon in their house? Yeah, the pig's name is Bacon. That's. <laughs> they don't give shit. That's uh. I used to have a pet pig when I was a kid. It's cool. I mean, it wasn't mine. It was my mom's. And it was fucking enormous. <laughs> That's big. Teacup pigs pig. do not stay teacup. Everyone should know that. There's got to be a reason you come up here. But yeah, it seems weird that it would be like that. You think you'd blow this up, but there was... Uh, maybe i got to throw the thing so he hits the Plague Rat in the middle. Who gives Because there's no up attack, right? So. Yeah. Look at this fucking asshole hopping around like goddamn Green Goblin throwing bombs and yelling about Peter Parker. I'm not going to take the time to clear all that. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah, this is like the most Mega Man looking part. Those things are horrifying. They look like little adorable chibi poofs. But when they get near Oof. you, their entire fucking head opens up and they're a mouth. They look like a man. <laughs> I couldn't I'm think so of proud that's what you went with. I couldn't think of what I actually wanted to say, so. Well. Oh. Yeah. The dankest of anchor throws. <laughs> How dank are your anchor throws? They're danker than most. Oh, I get it. They're terrible. No, I needed you to get treasures. Most foul. <laughs> ah! Every enemy. Have you have such a codependent relationship with the enemies in this game. Yeah. Whatever. It's not like I like treasure. I already got my red armor. I don't need Yeah, what treasure. else are you going to fucking buy? Um, health and mana upgrades, I guess. Nah. Max out you shit, yo. Mr. Mike, check out my high-level HP. Yeah. So, but Jesse, if you had skills, bitch. you wouldn't need that. Uh, Jesse plays the uh, slacker roommate in uh, BoJack Horseman. Oh, yeah, he does. Man, everybody learned something. And Will Arnett is the is BoJack Horseman. Man, we learned two things right before the end of the episode, babe. 
Oh god, I didn't realize we were in it. It's a learning experience. 